to the next video in today's video i will show you how to do gesture recogni recognition in native android app using media pipe so first of all i will show you the demo so this is the demo for my android app and here you can see i have one text view and i have one button called pick image once i click on the button it opens the image picker when and if i select one image so i will select the thumbs up image and here you can see it is uh, able to tell okay thumbs up uh, left uh, so yeah let's see how to do this uh, in native android app firstly you will have to go to this documentation over here and uh, you will have to go to the model section go to click on this model section and from over here you will have to download this tensorflow light model once you download it as you can see i have just created a native android project i am using xml layout but if you want you can use jetpack compose as well next uh, here i have just uh, right click new folder assets folder and click on finish i have already created this inside your assets folder you will have to drag and drop that tensorflow light model which you have downloaded uh, once that is done you will have to go to build.gradle.kts and here you will have to add this dependency for google media pipe task vision once you add this just click on sync now next inside activity underscore main i have taken a text view as well as one button and uh, next we go to the main activity here i have uh, initialized our variable for text view and button uh, and here i am initializing it inside on create method also i have created our base options builder and set the model asset path now be careful with this name whatever name you have over here make sure you use the same name over here then i have created this base options using base options dot builder then i'm initializing our gesture recognizer and gesture recognizer options then setting our base options and setting the minimum uh, hand detection confidence as 0 0.5 uh, min tracking confidence as 0 0.5 and min hand presence confidence as 0 0.5 and the running mode is of image uh, then the options is of options builder dot build and here i have created a variable for our gesture recognizer then uh, here i am just initializing our gesture recognizer from our and passing our activity context as well as our options and once the button is clicked i am just calling this get content dot launch and i am passing the mime type of images because we are selecting images and as you can see the callback comes over here so i'm using register for activity result and if you see we are we will get the uri first and we uh, move it to the background thread like the io coroutine and from that we get the media uri from that media uri we actually generate a bitmap we convert it to a specific format of rgb uh, 888 uh, and uh, from that bitmap we are converting it to an mp uh, image so if you see over here it is a type of mp image uh, which is required by our gesture recognizer then we just call gesture recognizer dot recognize mp image now if the result is not equal to null then on the main thread what i'm doing i'm first checking if uh, gesture uh, rec if the gestures result dot gesture is not equal to empty and i'm just getting the first gesture which again i'm checking is not equal to empty uh, then i'm just doing result dot gestures zero zero dot category name similarly for handedness as well so i'm just appending whatever is the value and pa just appending the display name to our text view so yeah that's it uh, thank you for watching bye